the score tells you. Um, we had nothing going tonight, nothing. So uh, we played a very experienced, hungry hockey club that had lost two in a row, and they came in and took control of the game and didn't let up. We we just had nothing going tonight. So. Uh, I mean, I listen when the whole team is bad in front of them. You know, we're not going to point our fingers at our, anybody. The whole team was bad. Goalie, defense, forward. So the whole team, we're not pointing fingers at anybody. Not an excuse, but explanation was all this stuff affect the game? No, no excuses. We just didn't have anything tonight. It's as simple as that. We couldn't make a pass. Couldn't handle a puck. Uh, bad decisions all over the ice. Got frustrated, tried to do too much individually. Um, none of those things work. No. No. We, we, Kelly told us right away he didn't have possession, so we knew it was offside. We weren't surprised. Who were we trying to get from John in his, in his return with, with Andre? Uh, it was just a different matchup tonight because we were trying to run Hack and, and Essa against the big line, the big heavy guys. Um, just um, listen, we need offense from John. We need him to play good defense. Um, he tried. It's just we had nothing going. And listen, again, the, the point one finger at one another, the guys, we're not doing that. We, the whole team was off. When the whole team is off like that, what do you do? No, they'll have. We have pride in that room. We we showed that we will battle back. We know we got a tough opponent coming in here on Sunday. We are well aware we've lost two game games in a row, and we are well aware that we're going to have to put a much better effort on the ice Sunday night. And we're going to count on pride to do that. Thanks. What's going on before the game, obviously. So, no excuses there. I think we got exposed today. Uh, mistakes got costly, and uh, they're a really good hockey team over there, so they punished for there. How are you feeling in the game? Uh, how are you feeling physically, and how do you feel tonight? Uh, body felt good. Uh, it's fun being back, but bad game, obviously. Another dash three, so uh, happy with that. How important is the rest of this home game? Uh, obviously, you have the all star break, but. Next yeah, every game matters for us. We knew that since the start uh, we had, so it's nothing changes. Uh, we're in one here, and uh, uh, we're climbing back on the road trip, and uh, we're going to make these other two games counter. Does your, does your role switch at all when you go from playing with Ryan or Essa to playing with the Stecker? No, I don't think so. Uh, I know I know what kind of player I am, and uh, I'm going to keep playing uh, my hockey to help this team win. Uh, not very good. What do you want to do better at? Uh, be more creative, uh, be more involved defensively and offensively. How did you see this one tonight? Obviously, the first play is just kind of a weird one with a goal call back, but did that affect you at all? Um, no, I don't think so. I think, of course, they scored a couple uh, on power play, and probably we shouldn't. Shouldn't have take the, taken those penalties, but yeah, I mean, of course we have to play better than, than this one, but yeah, just forget this one and move on and focus on, on Sunday's game. Were you guys doing well on the road that you didn't do tonight? Um, playing hard, for check hard. I think we we didn't force it well tonight and uh, probably didn't play that hard uh, what we did on the road, but yeah, we have to watch some video and uh, let's see what, what went wrong. What are you guys being asked to do offensively uh, to, to generate goals and generate chances? Um, make plays, play with the puck. Uh, of course, when when there's a chance, go for check and take it back. And yeah, it's just basic st basic things. Shoot a lot. Uh, yeah, but yeah, nothing special. Just basic things. How much did you know about Sergey Zubov, and did you learn anything more this week? Oh, uh, not much to be honest. Uh, I was pretty young when when he played, but yeah, I've seen seen some some highlights and stuff. Uh, yeah, was of course great player and uh, really really fun to watch. Is it cool to be a part of something like this? I mean, there's only six retired numbers, so that's pretty uh, Yeah, of course it's it's pretty cool. It's it's rare, like you said. Uh, it's it doesn't happen happen too often. So yeah, it, it was fun fun to see that and 
be a part of it. For you guys on the back end, does it affect your game at all, the constant shuffling and preparing? Um, no, not really. I don't think so. I think everyone is great, great players, so I uh, can play with everybody. Thank you.